guys, welcome back to another YouTube video. It's Kira, and today I am going to be getting ready for the first day of school. I have all the feelings. I am nervous, excited, and all stuff like that. So, tonight is the night before, so I'm just going to be getting everything all ready, like my first day of school, first day of school outfit, and stuff like that. So, the reason I did this is because technically today was my first day of school but because I am in the like leadership program I spent the whole day today doing grade 9 orientation so I didn't go to any of my classes so technically for me tomorrow is my first day of school all I have is my locker picked out in the school um, because we did that on our break at lunch um so yeah I have all my stuff packed so here's my bag and then I have And then I have both my binders and then I also have a locker shelf because because my locker this year has two shelves on the top and none on the bottom and I like to have one on the bottom to put my binders on and then the top ones for like my emergency kit and other stuff so I got that and my bag is gonna be so heavy because I think I also have to bring my laptop to school but I'm still deciding on that because it might like just be too heavy and I could just borrow a school Chromebook but yeah so come get ready for me for the first day of school all right so first day of school outfit I already have it planned out so I'm going to show you guys them in a second so I got these cute jeans from blue notes and then I'm just going to be wearing my pale pink shirt that I got for my birthday I haven't worn that shirt yet so it's perfect it's the perfect chance to wear it so yeah and then maybe I'll decide necklaces tomorrow. I have quite a few options, which I'll show you. And yeah, so here's what I'm thinking for the outfit. So here's my pale pink shirt. Very basic, but cute. And then these are the jeans I got from Blue Notes. They, I love the wash on them. They're super cute. I'll show you guys like the try on like I'll show you guys the fit tomorrow morning because I'm not putting it on now um I already took my shower for the night but it's not a hair washing day so that's why my hair is not wet um so yeah I'm in my pajama shirt right now but anyways so here are the necklace options so we have my heart with a k some butterflies a flower or just like a plain like a little dainty chain I'm gonna test it out tomorrow and see which one will look the best um, but yeah, I've been super getting into necklaces lately and I just love that I have more options now. Um, uh, and I'm definitely going to keep buying more. Alright, so now to get ready and be looking all fresh, I'm going to do a little face mask. So this is one from the body shop. I already ripped open the top. Um, so yeah, it's, it's literally a sheet mask. So I'm going to look crazy, but let's put it on. <laughs> so welcome egghead Kira. And here's the mask. I just need to unfold it. Oh my gosh, these are always so big and never fit properly on my face. But this is why I like clay masks better, but she masks are fun too. Oh my god, look at it! <laughs> I need to be lying down. All right, I'll be back in 15 minutes to take this off. All right, it's been 15 minutes. Time to take this off. That feels so good. All right, and now we're just going to rub it in. See, I really wish I had a rose quartz like facial roller because those do so well with these masks. I'm definitely going to try and get one. I'm putting it on my Christmas list. So... With all that being said, I'll see you guys tomorrow morning when I get ready and leave for school. Here is my first day of school outfit. So, and I chose my necklace with my with the heart and a K. Also, I realized I didn't tell you my courses. So I have French, then English, then math, and then I have a spare. But I also have an online course, so I'm probably gonna do the online course. During my spare, I don't know why they put the online course outside of the timetable, but that's what they did. 
um, but I have a guidance counselor's appointment today, so we'll see if that changes anything. Um, so, and my online class is marketing, which should be interesting. So I'm now walking to my bus stop, the route you guys have all seen before. I have to put my hand here or else it makes my face disappear. See? Now you can see me kind of, I don't know, the lighting is off. I'm in the library right now on Spare and I dropped out of my online course so now I'm just hanging out with my friends. Alright, it's so bright but I'm walking back home from school. Day one complete. Um, how I feel about it, I don't know. I mean, in math class, we didn't even do math. We literally played with cards. And, like, not like card games. Just figuring out a certain pattern of cards to make it deal in order when they're not, like, in order. It's hard to explain. But, yeah. French and English were okay, and then my spare was fun. I'll talk more in detail later. Alright, so I'm back home now, and it's time to end up this video but also give you guys a little recap of my day so first period I had French which was okay we did some grammar review and um, I realized I realized this every year my French like grammar verb conjugation is not the greatest and every year I learn it and then I forget it and then I learn it and then I forget it and then it's just that vicious cycle um, but then halfway through that period, I got called down to guidance because I was number four to get some things switched on my schedule. So I dropped my e-learning course for this semester and I'm taking it next semester. So now I have a spare that I can use to do anything I want, <laughs> which is very good. Um, and then my, in my French class, she also posted an assignment, which it's like a very easy project. Um, and because I missed most of that class when everyone got it done, I have to do it now for homework, which is kind of sad, but it's really easy, simple, so I can just get that done in like 20, 30 minutes, so it's all good, um, and I did get a little bit of time to start it. And then second period, I had English with a new English teacher to the school. She seems very nice, um, and yeah, we just did very, very basic things. We did a little bit of journal writing about a random topic, but she's not gonna mark the journal, she's not even looking at it, but it's just like to get you in the creative mindset. And then we also worked on an analytical paragraph, which is gonna be our first assignment. We're starting tomorrow, um, and it's gonna be due Friday. She's marking it, but it's not gonna count. Um, it's just so that we know her marking style and what she expects of us and stuff like that. So that's easy, chill, cool. I can probably get that done tomorrow in class because we have the whole class time to do it um and then lunch was super fun um i just hung out with my friends and we talked which is what we always do and then in math we did this thing with cards i think i said something about it um but basically it was like you had five cards and then you would have to order them in a way where you could, you could place one then put the next one at the bottom of the deck place one and then it'd be in order one to five and then once you figured out how to do it with five cards, you have to try to do it with six cards, seven cards, all the way up to 13. Um, we kind of got it, <laughs> kind of. Like up to 13, it was just very hard, but it's fine. I don't know how what that has to do with grade 12 advanced functions math, but like, hey, we did nothing basically that whole class, it was fine. Um, and then I had a spare and I have a spare with two of my other friends, which was super fun. We just hung out, talked, laughed, all the things but I know as the days go on we're gonna use that time to work on stuff either together like help each other out or just do our own homework <laughs> while sitting near each other um, so yeah that was super fun and yeah so that was my first day um, so now I got to go take a shower it's hair washing day get ready for bed finish my French thing um, I can prep for my English thing but like I have all of class tomorrow um, and then go to bed and do this all again tomorrow. <laughs>
So I hope you guys enjoyed my first day of school vlog. If you did, give it a big thumbs up, subscribe, and I will see you guys all in the next one. Bye!